Hi everybody, it's Carl here from the Derbyshire branch of the Dry Stone Wall Association with a little update on where we all are at at the moment. I hope you're all keeping well. Um, we think we're going to do this every month actually. It seems like a pretty nice way of keeping in touch and I think regardless of when we get back to full-time meetings we'll probably kind of keep, it, keep in touch in this in this method and we'll, um, you know, it's quite nice for people to see what's going on and not everyone can get to meetings as well. So um, We had uh, Mick Bales' of seeds that um, we planted. I think he might have had the last laugh actually as far as I'm concerned because we seem to have a bed full of weeds but you never know. But um, Mick um, Parsons, uh, Mick number two, um, sent this picture in and uh, it's showing his seeds coming on rather nicely so I hope everybody's had a bit of luck with the seeds, that's really nice. I'm hoping that ours come up in the coming weeks but we shall see. Um, quick happy birthday to Simon Patterson, 64. Doesn't look a day over 65 so well done Simon for staying on the planet. Um, and also a hello to Phil Benjamin who got in touch through the week. Um, he seems to be nice and busy which is good so hi Phil. Um, as you're probably all aware, spending is completely on hold at the moment um, for obvious reasons. We're in a good shape financially. We may at some point have to offer support to other branches or head office, so hence we're keeping everything on hold completely at the moment on expenditure. Um, please do look out, those of you who are self-employed, for the scams from HMRC that have been sent around. Um, I got a few comments back when we sent the email out. It's unbelievable what sort of levels people stoop to, but uh, just be aware of those scams, they are around. Um, for those of you who like to do a bit of walling with these rather lovely hammers, um, I've got a new batch in. Give me a shout if you want to purchase one, I'll only be too happy to get one to you. I can pop it in the post as well if that helps you at the moment. Um, we've had a few inquiries via the branch uh, for work. Um, just a quick note really, it's real important that we reply to everybody, get back to everybody. We have had a few um, um, potential customers who phoned up to say that uh, nobody got back to them or they got a poor response and that reflects on the whole branch so please do when you get an inquiry at least have the courtesy to go back and maybe say you can't do it or you know someone who might be able to that be a good reflection on, on, on the branch. Um, head office have uh, been in touch as well they really like our videos because they were keen on looking at new ways of moving forward and keeping in touch with people so um, we sent a copy of the last email to Alison HQ and she was um, um, quite happy with that, which is nice to know. Um, we've had some conversations in the background um, regarding novice courses. It's our firm belief at the moment that these probably will not take place anytime soon, maybe not even this year. We're not happy with the fact that you need close attention and people need uh, close at hand advice. You need to get in there with groups. It's a collaborative and team effort, a novice course, as, as a lot of warning is. And therefore, we're not happy for the safety of our hosts, our instructors and the attendees. But on a note about practice weekends for our um, uh, members who like to come on the practice weekends to hone their skills, this might be something we can facilitate. So we're thinking of, uh, of with the blessing of a host site, uh, to set, perhaps set up a weekend. It may or may not be instructive, but we believe we can do some gapping isolated on one of our host sites. If anybody's interested, please give me a shout and we'll try and set that up for you in, in due course. Um, I've had um, uh, an email from Phil Coates, uh, thanks Phil, um, and he's, he's involved with um, a scheme called Rural Action Derbyshire. So get in touch with Rural Action Derbyshire should you need help regarding issues. Um, they're a good organisation to go and take a look at anyway and see what they do on a wider issue or get in touch with Phil Coates directly, so thanks a lot Phil. Um, and then finally, I'd like everyone to start sending in pictures if they can via email to our info address. This very interesting picture came through, somebody has been seen lurking recently by a dry stone wall. Um, we're not sure whether he's any good at walling or not, it certainly doesn't look like it. And certainly it looks like he's missed the boat on the uh, clippers that were for sale on Amazon when the virus first struck. So I've no idea who he is. Um, I have reported it to the police and um, I will update you at the next meeting. So stay well everyone. Um, hope you're all okay. That rounds up the updates for uh, this month. See you soon. Take care.